Uh, how you doing, Gail? I'm good today, Robert. How are you? Uh, I couldn't be more blessed. Uh, I'm here. I mean, that's all I can ask for, you know? Yeah. It's been a while since you've done an interview. Um, I was just wondering why you're here with me today. Uh, well, Gail, you know, it's been a lot of scrutiny about me. Uh, a lot of people have ridden me off, uh, ran over me with the bus, tarnished my name, stopping my money. Uh, a lot of people just think I'm the black sheep of the family, Gail, and, uh, I'm here to tell my side of the story today and let people know I'm not going. I won't smoke with anybody to go up, head up with me, knuckles, bare knuckles, whatever they want to do. I'm from Chicago, girl, and I'm letting people know that I'm here and it's whatever with me. Okay. That's why I'm here, girl. Okay, Robert. And I need that check y'all going to give me. Okay. So what are some of the allegations and lies and... And things you've heard about yourself that are oh not true. Oh my gosh! Uh, uh, all of them. Uh, someone said they caught me walking in a bar that's twenty one and up. You know why would I be in there? Uh, they said I'm running a uh, uh, what is it called a, a coat? I don't even know what a coat is. But if I had to guess what a coat was, I would say it's some strange organization or some grown ass man brainwashing little girls or something. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? And uh, maybe I am running a coat. And uh, you know, someone said I have women in my basement called time. I don't even know how to haul tie. When I was young, my grandfather used to have me haul tie the pigs to cook them in the yard. I could never catch the pig and haul tie, so I got a whooping. So I don't know how to haul tie, you know, you know? And last but not least, someone said they caught me putting in an application to be a Girl Scout leader. Like, come on now. I love Thin Mints. You love Thin Mints, right? Yeah. They love Thin Mints, but come on now, girl. That's not me. I didn't do that. Okay. Come on now. Now, it was 50 women that said you've abused them. Uh-huh. You actually made a rap song about it. Now, when you say a rap song, what you mean? Well, let me play that for you. Okay, because I, I mean, it wasn't 50. I know I, I, I slept with 49 of them. But I'm okay. Made a hit, didn't I? Made a hit, then they lying on me though. Tracy didn't give me her number. Tracy didn't give me her number. That's it. Tracy didn't give me her number. I'm gonna tell you like this. I'm gonna tell you like this, girl. Cause I almost slapped that goddamn big ass phone out your hand. Fifty of those women, right? If you notice, none of them had anything good to say about me. They're describing Lucifer, not Robert. They want to bury me alive, but I'm alive. Come on. So so you're telling me you never held anyone against their will? Why would I? Come on, think. Hold on, where's the camera at? Is this camera on me right here? Right there. Think. Why would I do that, guys? Come on, I don't have to do that. Hold somebody against their will. I'm Robert. Come on, think. Stop playing with me. That's not me. I'm fighting for my fucking life here, man. I'm trying to kill you with this shit, man. Come on, give y'all 30 years. 30 years. And y'all want to kill me? You killing me, man. Come on, shit. Come on, man. Did y'all want to say I had four or five women uh, uh, held against their wheel ranging from the ages of 21 and 22 years old? I don't want them old hoes. I like them young. And then, and then, I, and then I, get out, I, I, I get out to Cook County and I go to the same McDonald's. They caught me paper time at and I ordered 30. 30. God damn it, nigga, I said 30 Happy Meals. 29 women, well, girls, one boy. I just ordered the boy just to throw everybody off because I ain't like that. Robert ain't like that. But come on, shit. Y'all killing me. I Robert, gave y'all hits. Robert. No, girl, shut your bald head ass up. I gave y'all hits. Bump and grind. You remind me of my Jeep. Says by the kitchen, over by the stove. We be making love and water butter rolls. Ain't no nigga gave y'all that hit. That's, that's y'all killing me, man. No, and Gail, you said we got your ball here, turtle without the shell looking ass up here, asking me all them questions. Right, right. You don't even believe me. Just calm down. And I bought you a mocha coffee from Starbucks. Hey, is, is, no, is the camera still rolling? It's rolling. Okay, look, guys. I'm not a monster, guys. You hear me? I'm not a monster. You hear me? Bill Cosby? That's a monster. You hear me? Suge Knight? His fat ass ran over two people. That's a monster. You hear me? Uh, Morgan Freeman? Uh, talking nasty sexual to his staff? 
That's a monster. You hear me? Robert Kraft. Nigga worth, uh, uh, how much he worth? Five billion dollars. Caught him with a prostitute. That's a monster. Harvey Weinstein, he went too far. That, that, nigga, that's enough. That's a monster. That's a monster. You hear me? My brother, my, my blood brother. Yo, my blood brother done sit up here and got fat. You know what I'm saying? You nigga normally take all my cases for me. You know what I'm saying? Now, let me be real. Since I beat that case in 2008, yeah, yeah, that was me on the tape. Yeah, I did it. huh? But his fat ass was supposed to say it was him. You see what I'm saying? He didn't say it was him. That's a monster. Fat as hell now. Caught him in an interview with a coat on, sheep coat on. That was my coat. That's a monster. Come on, I didn't do this, God. Stop fucking playing with me. I'm trying to be in my life. I'm trying to, and it's not about music. I'm trying to get some young hoes. Y'all don't want to see that.